Hello, good morning. I hope you've had a good day so far. I've been having, um, it's been taking a long time to post these. I actually get up very early in the morning to um, do this, but then it um, takes a long time for me to get it from my camera to YouTube, um, hours sometimes. So I'm awaiting another camera, hoping to film from my laptop rather than my phone and hopefully that will work but we'll see I'm just going to keep on moving along and I'm going to keep doing this as much as I can regardless of my equipment so um I did not have a spiritual thought today except for God's will be done uh, which can sometimes be a very scary thought or it can be a very happy thought it just depends on <sighs> <laughs> on the day <laughs> so uh, today I brought my tiger eye my big old I'm not exactly positive it's a tiger eye but it sure does look like one it's real pretty um, that's where this one is it's under this card on the far right and then we have my selenite which I like to call seleniite because my daughter um, uses the Greek pronunciation of her name and she pronounces all the vowels Selene um, here's my what is it I keep saying what oh citrine it's a is that quite amber maybe an amber citrine but it's not exact it's not amber it's a rock and then we have this guy right here which I consider to be particularly beautiful Especially these veins of colors that look like turquoise that go through the middle of it. And I'm going to put that one right here. So what I need you to do is to pick which... Whoops! Let me get that back. Oh, look, we have a frog in the camera. Uh, I'm filming with my uh, cord on. My charger cord. And... <clears throat> I accidentally pulled on it. Then let's take this little fella and put him somewhere else. So he's not distracting. Oh, let's see. Frog. Um, deep magic. The knowledge of ancient wisdom. The underworld. Did you know? Okay, here's my thought. It's not a necessarily a spiritual thought. It's a scientific thought or a science thought. <laughs> Did you know that some frogs can like go dig themselves down into the mud deep, 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 deep and then go into a coma-like trance and completely bodies can completely dry up with the mud. And if that mud gets wet again as much as years and years later, that frog will rehydrate and come out of that trance and get back up and live as if he just woke up. Isn't that great? Okay, here we go. We're going to start with this tiger eye card. Is that the one we should start with? I guess since I said we were, that's what we'll start with. Let's turn him over. The Knight of Raws. Look at his mad face. It's not mad. He's determined. He is a very willful knight. He's a knight. Um, but not like the Sir Lancelot knight of yesterday. He is very into um, action rather than words. He doesn't talk much. He takes care of business. Um, <clears throat> one of the things about him that you need to watch out for if you pick this card today is that he can be a little bit arrogant he can be a little bit immature and unpredictable um but he is an eliminator of fear he takes care of the bullies he's not gonna let somebody stand around and get bullied um, this card, I really think this could be a person in your life, or this could be you, but I think it's you. Um, one thing that I'd like to mention about this card is sometimes it has to do with 
a change of residence. So if you are moving, this is a time of determination for you to find another place to live. Maybe you're moving today. I don't think so. I think he is in process. And if you put the tiger eye, that's your card today, the Knight of Rods. Now I'm going over to the Selenium. Oh, uh, Selenite. Selenite. Not Selenium. That's a whole different thing. This guy is your card today. The Page of Cauldrons, which is also the Page of Hearts. Um, a page is often a messenger. Um, this particular messenger... Um, is a is a good mediator when it comes to business. Um, he's a person that serves. He is he is a page after all. Page of the heart. He does enjoy making dreams a reality. I don't know what you dreamed last night, but my dream might make a nice reality. <laughs> I don't think that's the kind of dream he means. Um, I want you to call on your intuition today. I want you to consider your childlike spirit and kind of uh, call on that today as well. Um, and listen for a message. It may be come in writing and it may come another way. And what would I suggest for you today? Well, it doesn't look like it's going to be a terrible day. That's what. And now we're going to go to the amber-colored citrine, the fiery, passionate stone. And we have a low card. The two of pentacles. It may be a low card, but we have a, lot, a little bit to say about this guy. Um, pentacles are also coins, which also means business or fortune, also can mean humanity. Um, this is a person that has not quite launched his business yet, or launched the, the, an idea that they have brewing. There's a good chance of success with what you're thinking about. But this is the planning phase, so you need to take some time and plan. I feel like this is my card today because, you know, I'm trying to start my tarot business and this is my gift. This is just the beginning. I want to do this every single day and read your daily cards as a gift, but then in hopes that, well, I'm taking out ads too. I'm not just doing YouTube, but in hopes that uh, it will grow my business, but it is in the early planning stages right now um this card says you're not quite ready to launch which does feel like me there are some obstacles in the way um you might have difficulty do that or are difficult with your problems but don't lose heart so for you i would say keep up the good work just keep going do a little bit every day and you'll be ready and you have a great set, set chance of success and that was under the amber citrine and here under this blue marble or gr blue green marble rock we have oh the nine of cups that is a wonderful card i like to call that the happy card um it is a card where he's he's with a loved one or a family member he's got plenty to eat cups or hearts which is love um success satisfaction um, so today I feel like you're going to be able to enjoy some of your sex, uh, so maybe you're going to enjoy some of your sex today, um, because it just came out of my mouth. Uh, success is what I meant to say, but I think, uh, I believe in stuff that comes out of my mouth. <laughs> I probably shouldn't, <laughs> but anyway, I would say that your chances are good of finding some familiar, familial and maybe conjugal happiness today with the nine of cauldrons and that is your card right there and i guess i'd just like to conclude this with saying i really appreciate you if you're watching today and please do like and subscribe my video it really helps me a lot kind of gauge where i am with my audience 
Um, I also love comments. Comments really make my day, especially if they have some helpful criticism in them. So, um, and, and if I don't bide your criticism, uh, it may be that I'm planning to because, um, you know, so just keep on, keep on helping me out here. I really appreciate it. And, oh, I guess I can show you my, um, I'll do that another day. We'll see what we have behind the cards because there's some special things back there. And, um, I hope y'all have a, a wonderful day. And keep on keeping on. Don't panic. <laughs> Thanks.